Hello everyone, welcome to another gaming news video. Earlier this morning, some information was released about the new Batman Arkham Knight game. It now has a release date and is now coming out June 2nd, 2015. It was supposed to come out October 15th, but then it was delayed for eight months. It's, it's exciting to know that it's, oh yay, it's coming out and stuff, and then it's like, now I gotta wait even longer to play it, which... Well, I guess it's still coming out, but now you have to wait another, however, months, eight more, instead of supposedly coming out February instead. So there's that, but we can all cope with that and get ready to play it June. Alongside this release date, they also revealed two collector's editions for the game. The first one is called Batman Arkham Knight Limited Edition, and the other one is called the Batmobile Edition. Two collector's editions, and their price range is completely different. The limited edition is $100, and it comes with an 80-page art book containing concept art, a steelbook case, a limited edition DC, Batman, Arkham Knight Zero comic, three unique skins from the new 52 comics, and a Batman memorial statue. This edition is only available on PC and console, so if you're a PC player, you want the limited edition, you're good to go, and then console players, you guys are good. The next edition is... The Batmobile edition costs $200, and it comes with everything that I mentioned above, plus a transformable Batman statue. This edition is only available on console, so if you're a PC player, you're out of luck. Unless you do have a console, you can play it on, you know, luck for it. So the editions do seem pretty cool. With the limited edition, you get a steelbook case, like they have with a bunch of other ones. Art book and whatnot, which is pretty cool. You get all this extra stuff for $100, and then a statue as well, which I guess isn't too bad a price considering what you're getting. And then if you get the Batmobile Edition, it's an extra $100 off the $100 for the limited edition. But then you also get the transformable Batman statue, which looks about this big or something, so it's not a bad size. It looks about the size, maybe, or even close to the size of the um, Lego Tumblr that just came out. Uh, what day is it today? Is it the 8th today? So it came out about a week ago today, so that'll... there's that. Which is pretty cool. I'm excited for when that comes out. I'll probably, I'll probably be getting the Transformable Batman one because I am a big fan of the Arkham games. They're a lot of fun. Arkham Sam was great. Arkham City was even better. Arkham Origins was pretty good. They just wasn't as good as Arkham City and Silent War and then Arkham Knight. This game is going to be amazing. Because if they delay an extra eight months, I can do so much more with it, make it a lot more fun and everyone for everyone to have and whatnot. So I'm excited for that. And I just gotta wait another well since September, then October, so I can wait nine months to play it, instead of the eight months, so that's just great, but can't wait to play it. Had a lot of fun with the other games, so I'm excited. So that's the big news for today. Batman Arkham Knight release date June second. Later today there'll probably be a trailer for it because they always have a trailer come out the day that they release something so if they do get put it up if they don't then don't worry about it but if they do there'll be a link in the in the description down below to go watch the trailer for that if it does come out so thanks for watching this video everyone hope you guys enjoyed it and let's stay tuned for Arkham Knight when it comes out